If you're one of the company's bosses or dreaming of becoming a CEO someday, then you should learn about the importance of studying strategic financial management goals. If you don't know what this is, don't worry, I got you. My name is Munif Ali and I became a self-made multimillionaire in my early 20s and have built multiple brick and mortar businesses with billions of dollars in sales. I started making videos to share my life experiences and so that I could teach others how to become more successful in life and in business. If you like the type of content that I'm giving you, please go ahead and smash that subscribe button, like the video and share it with people who might find this video helpful. What is this strategic financial management you ask? Strategic financial management means managing the company's finances to ensure that it will meet its objectives and succeed as a business. It comprises of financial decision making and developing financial goals and creating financial controls, all of which are strategies to help your company gain a positive return on investment, also known as ROI. A lot of entrepreneurs just want to start a business, but there's a lot more to it and you need to really understand how money works to be able to have a successful business as well. Strategic financial management can also help you with having a deeper understanding of how to obtain liabilities and assets for your company. And if all this sounds crazy and complex, it really is not. You'll be continuously monitoring and making plans to adjust your business strategies while providing you with a better position among your competitors to achieve your goals. Let me break all that down. All that jargon means you need to understand, just like on a personal budget, how much money is coming in, how much money you're gonna be utilizing in your business, where it's gonna go, is it gonna to go to marketing, is it gonna to go to staffing, is it gonna to go to benefits, is it going to go towards the parking lot repair? It's just figuring out where your money is gonna go, how it moves, and how money and profitability comes and how it goes out. So I know the words might be complex, but you need to think about this as an entrepreneur, as you start to get in business and as your business ramps up. And with that being said, if you can do all this stuff correctly, you'll be able to increase your company's profitability and ensure that your business stays in business. So what's the importance of all of this strategic financial management? The whole thing is that you need to study how money comes in and what the relationship to the money is in your business. You need to study strategic financial management so that you can make rational decisions when problems arise and so that you can align where your business is with what your ultimate goals are. The whole thing is about knowing where your goals are and what your goals are. Your business will be able to determine how it gets its money and the requirements and the resources needed to achieve the ultimate goals that you set for your business anyway. It'll help you determine like what kind of structure you're gonna have, meaning that you'll be able to identify what is going to be best suited for your business style and goals. And you'll have an easier time later when you start to get funding as well. It will also help you raise certain type of funds that will generate more profit, giving you an exact number of what needs to be reinvested and what you could take out as far as profitability is concerned. Now, practicing strategic management will also help you focus on long-term goals and short-term goals. For example, during the pandemic, a lot of companies had to close down some of its stores and reduce the number of staff to help the company survive. By sacrificing their goals to expand, they were able to stay afloat, giving them more opportunities in the future to chase their unfulfilled goals. It's a hard decision to make sometimes, but you need to really consider strategic financial management goals in order to make the correct choices in the business. There you have it. I can't stress some of this enough because there's a lot of entrepreneurs out there and there's a lot of finance people or financially minded people, but the two don't always mesh. A lot of times entrepreneurs will start a business and their books are a mess, their accounting is a mess, they don't really know how money's coming in or how money's going out. And I've been a victim of that as well. I've run several very successful companies where I had a lot of money coming in, but I had no idea where it was all going and what it meant. And I was shocked at the end when I finally looked at the books. So I've learned throughout the years, and this is the kind of advice that I give you. Heartfelt, real deal, 
don't want anything, just want to let you know some of the pitfalls with being an entrepreneur and not being a prepared entrepreneur. And it doesn't matter if you apply strategic financial management goals in your business or in your life, the terms are exactly the same. So there you have it. So these are the reasons why you need to learn this strategic financial management goals right now, even before you start a business. It'll help you decide and make complicated but rational decisions for the betterment of you, your livelihood, and your company and business. And you'll be able to prioritize your long-term goals while making profits at the same time. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't hesitate to like and hit the subscribe button. Comment down below if you want to share some of these thoughts. If you're interested in learning more about business tips and getting rich, check out this video, the five tips on becoming a millionaire faster than I did.